Hey guys. Hey guys. Hey guys. Hey guys. Hey guys. Hey guys. Oh my god, I fucking hate doing introductions. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be talking about a new mask I am try I've am i tried out and I really liked. So as you can see, my face is fucking horrible. Horrible. Look at that shit, man. Like from the last update to now, I feel like my face is um, really bad. I don't know if it's like stress or what's going on but i feel like i'm back to point a but anyway this oatmeal mask that i'm going to be talking about is pretty awesome i went to daiso um it's my local japanese like little store and a friend brought me this like cucumber peel off mask and it actually pulled off a lot of my face so i was like oh so i was like oh i'm gonna give their stuff a try right so i went and bought an oatmeal oxygen bubble mask which is this one so i already used the first one I have a, it comes with two packages the first one and the second one is down here so when I used it I didn't realize it was a bubble mask I just saw oatmeal and then I saw the deep clean and brightening oxygen foam formula oatmeal and papaya extract but I didn't realize what I was actually putting on I just saw deep clean and I was like oh I'm gonna try it so I did and honestly I think it's freaking cool it's like a cool ass mask at first I was like what the hell why is it why is it bubbling like this why is it foaming and then I was like okay let me go back and reread it and then I did reread it and I just like another thing that told me was oatmeal because when I was younger um I used to put oatmeal on my face because my grandma used to tell me to put oatmeal and it was good for you this was like before the breakouts and I haven't been doing that anymore or tried it or experimented with it this isn't like to cure acne or anything like that it's just like for deep clean and brightening so I did want to brighten up like all these new scars that I have which are pretty bad like this is a pimple that I did mess with like earlier today yeah so sad and then over here, mm -hmm, you see that? It's terrible. And then up here, pulls. Como la ven, eh? This acne struggle is real, you guys. Anyway, let me get back to the oatmeal mask. So it's pretty cool. I really like it. From voting from a 1 to 10, I gave it like a, a 9. So I really liked it. And I say a 9 because like this is not a cure for acne, right? I think this is such a cool mask. If you haven't tried it and don't have like an acne problem, I think this would be really cool. Um, and even if you do have an acne problem like me, then I think that you would really like this mask too because I really liked it. I thought it was so freaking awesome. And I keep saying that. I need to show you what I mean. But I was like, what? What's going on? Oh my god. Like, it looks so cool. So I'm going to go ahead and show you. Oh, something I forgot to mention. The mask does say avoid using on blemishes, pimples, irritate, irritated or sunburned skin. So I didn't have any kinds of reactions, but I guess you should be, I guess you should listen to whatever it says on here. And um, well, I did it because I just, I saw cleanse and oatmeal and I'm like, I'm gonna give it a try and I did and I liked it. So yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and get started. Here to put it on. I do not keep scissors back here, but I sure do keep a knife. It is like a cream substance looking thing. It's like creamy and then you just want to put it on. See, it's already starting to foam up on this side. So you can see like I have not even rubbed it on and it just does it on its own. I'm just going to wait a little bit longer and then rub it for about 30 to 60 seconds. So, for right now, I'm just gonna leave it a little bit longer. Okay, the bubble mask is like, it's getting in my mouth. Okay, there. Yeah, look at that. Isn't it so cool? It's like awesome. You're gonna wanna rub it in for 30 seconds, they say? 30 to. Oh, that shit went in my nose. Whenever you wash this off, it's not very, like, easy. The takeoff is kind of sticky, so you gotta just kind of keep washing it. I'm just gonna go wash this off, and I'll be right back. Just kidding. I'll be right back. Okay, so I washed my face already. I feel like it makes it look a little bit brighter and shiny. My face is dry already. If I didn't have all of this going on and all of this going on, 
and the little of this going on, I would be so much more satisfied. But no, I gotta have this ugly ass acne all over my face and scars. I got this mask at Daiso. It was $1.50 there. So if you have like a Daiso near you, you can probably get it there. If not, I did find them on Amazon and I'll link it down below. So yeah, that's pretty much it guys. I just really like this mask and from the first time I used it, I didn't see any difference on my acne or anything like that. But I did notice uh, my face get like brighter and shinier and it feels really good and it feels soft after I use it. So yeah, I really liked it and I thought it was so cool. I think it's so cool how it like bubbles up. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up. Um, I really recommend this mask. It says not to use if you have like on a pimple or whatever, but honestly I didn't like feel any irritation or anything like that. But then that, again, that's my skin. Feel free to share with anybody you know that would like to try this mask. It's a fun mask and it would be even more fun if you had like friends if you were doing it with friends or with your sister or family or whatever because it's pretty cool how it bubbles up you know what i'm saying so yeah peace guys